In 1970, frustrated with the music industry and reeling from the death of Tammy Terrell, his duet partner, Marvin Gaye decided he wanted to try a new career, pro football player. He started training with Mel Farr and Lem Barney, two starters for his favorite team, the Detroit Lions, and added 30 pounds to his 6'4 frame. When Gay approached Lions coach Joe Schmidt about trying out for the team, Schmidt asked him if he had any game tape. That's when the coach learned that Marvin Gay had no formal football experience, in college or even in high school. Undeterred, Gay told Schmidt, quote, If you give me a chance, the first time I touch the ball, I'll score a touchdown. Schmidt wasn't willing to let one of Motown's biggest stars get injured, however, ending Marvin Gaye's NFL career before it even began. But his collaboration with the Lions continued in 1971 when he released What's Going On, the second biggest hit of his career, with Mel Farr and Lem Barney singing backup vocals. <laughs> 